Lur Guru says a chicke, you shall. Should we um, do this uh, breathing, well, the nine rounds of breathing together? What would you like to do? Just fun. Still a fun. Then the Chazu Kujaka Yuji check him to stay. Those people who are on chair, and all right, all right, not problem. All right, problem. That's uh, enough. The the Naroba six yoga practice is these practices quite clear, uh, quite clearly mentioned. That's enough. La chair. Hold your hand and um, form a fist with your uh, uh, thumb inside. You see, thumb. You see, you should, you see uh, the uh, ring finger at the, uh, well, uh, the, the base of the ring finger. finger. Press the, your thumb on the base of the ring finger. Mm. Now those good. And then hold and make a fist. Mm. Uh, uh, while I do, you see, you just you see, copy. This is a muscle, this is a muscle. <laughs> what did no, this yeah. end? This end. <laughs> no, first to the right, left. First to the left. Uh, here, here, here. First one. Now second. Now this side. Oh, right, right hand and left hand. Now both, now hand like this. Now here, one difference is when uh, breathing in, uh, breathing in the way. No. In, like this. Breathing out, like that. Mm. Now again, three times. So this practice, I think you can do, uh, particularly when your mind a little bit sort of uh, uh, disturbed or uh, the turbulence, right? Yeah. Agitated. 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 Then completely forget about the, the, the causes and just as a concentrated breathing and do that, that could be something like tranquilizer. <laughs> 
the disturbed mind somehow neutralize, right? neutralize right? Uh, uh, that. So of course, then you see, prop, the according tantric, uh, the tantric practitioner, uh, if you see the someone who really, you see the uh, seriously practice tantra, then of course we have to visualize the, the as I mentioned earlier, lalana, rasana, our duty, our duty. Then these chakras, and then uh, this, this certain area here or here or here. This is some letters, letter, slippers, like that. Or here, or okay, no, okay, like that. So then our mind quite sort of calm. Then visualize the object. Uh, generally, the, for Buddhist, the image of Buddha, uh, I think this size, one inch, uh, in, in, front of, in front of you, the Kasori Teme. The Buddha image should be at the uh, level of your uh, mid eyebrow. And distance. Uh, about uh, four feet, four five feet distance, and the uh, the height of the height of and with the image and with the image uh, very very bright one, a lot of light, and Im sort of imagine heavy, so that the uh, visualize heavy uh, some sort of effect your mind. Stand still, right? Uh, not not going into mental thinking. Uh, no. No. no, to to help to uh, no, not scattered. No. Mm. Then bright, a lot of light, uh, that helps your mind more clear, not dull, like that. And then to Christian, Christian practitioner, there's Jesus Christ. Um, or Mary carry the young Jesus Christ. Jesus, a wonderful, really symbol of love. Or then, uh, Muslim practitioner, perhaps even in Mecca, the temple, visualize. Now here, the object not Kasota, the seeing object. No. But firstly, we look Buddha statue or Jesus Christ or Mary or Mecca or uh, then reflectory no. in our mind. The eye consciousness now eventually should be Kasota. Inactive. Ka. Inactive, not functioning. Oh, Kasota sees. Right? No. Actually, Kasota. Firstly, neutralize. Then, the sixth mind. Then concentrate on the image of that object in the mind. Once you see that get used and, and remain longer, longer, longer period, then the sensorial consciousness automatically become very weak. Then no longer any disturbances. Uh, Or you see the Buddha or Jesus Christ or I think a Mecca temple or God in the form of light. That also is possible, I think. Light uh, uh, that instead of outside, but here inside, and the center of two kasa, numani parati. No, in the cent uh, center of two breath. Oh, no. yeah. A form of light. Or Buddha, or Kasota, just guys like that. That object to concentrate our mind. So um, when you do yes, this, no. yes, in uh, Master Asanga's uh, Shoraka Bhumi and other texts, there is mention of the image or the reflection of um, 
and um, is it the uh, object in your mind? <coughs> so then, now the obstacle, uh, mainly two things. One, synthetic. So one obstacle is the uh, distraction, mental distraction. Uh, uh, antidote or countermeasure for that is mindfulness. Uh, you remember the object, your mind fully sort of concentrate on it. Then, Shishing Sharaja. And then you use vigilance to check whether the mind is staying on the object or getting distracted. Then another obstacle, although your mind still remain on the object, but not very clear, not, not, not sort of full alert mind, mental state, limited thing. Yes. Yeah. And that also one great obstacle, particularly is it a long period? Uh, then, if that is a sickness, familiarize, that is quite easier. And also, you get some kind of relax. Uh, so, in a way, one of the best method, relaxation. <laughs> so, if that uh, get used, then sharpness of our mind reduce. Very dangerous. So mind remain on the object fully. At the same time, mind should be full alert. So that's important. That the kasole sevo ya neva jeme the chonche. So in order for us to have this clarity of mind when you stay on and you focus. I mean, uh, in meditation, the obstacle is um, the, the, that hinders it is called mental sinking. Uh, it is a counter because of the countermeasure is your mind should be alert, and in order to develop that kind of alertness, is your mind something because of the happy, full of enthusiasm. Then that come some kind of demoralize. Hopelessness, then completely sink. So, full sort of the enthusiasm it is the main sort of the countermeasure. And then, mind becomes more alert like that. So, that's the way. Then, through that way, the so so the tension comes to the So, the, uh, the most important thing when you cultivate a single pointed meditation is to. Uh, build up your mindfulness and this vigilance. Hmm? So that's about practice of shamatha. There's a common. All, I think, ancient uh, Indian tradition is common. Uh, then also, I was told, an ancient sort of city Christian practitioner, also I same sort of practice. Perhaps I think Muslim also, I think. Uh, 